from the Lakeside Newsroom of the Henrico Citizen, your hometown news source since 2001. This is the Henrico News Minute with publisher Tom Lapis. Henrico police are seeking the driver involved in an apparent fatal hit and run in the far west end Saturday night. And tonight, high school bands take center stage at Godwin High School. We'll have details in today's Henrico News Minute. It's Monday, October 18th, 2021. And now for the news. A 27-year-old man died Saturday night in Henrico's far west end after an apparent hit and run accident. The male, Deshaun S. Johnson, was found lying in the roadway at Knuckles Road near Hickory Park Drive by a Henrico police officer who happened to be passing by shortly before 11 that night. The officer rendered aid immediately and called for EMS services, but Johnson was taken to a hospital where he later died. The detectives are asking anyone who traveled east along Knuckles Road between 10.30 and 10.45 on Saturday night between Twin Hickory Road and I-295 who might have seen anything related to the fatal crash to call them. They say there's no detail too small as they search for the driver who apparently left the scene. If you have information, call Officer Shoemaker at 928-0033 or submit your tips online at p3tips.com through Metro Richmond Crime Stoppers anonymously, or you can also call Crime Stoppers at 780-1000. A new insurance company has chosen Henrico County for its new headquarters. Richmond National Group Incorporated is a startup specialty property and casualty insurance holding company. It'll invest at least $175,000 to establish headquarters in the West End and is expected to create about 70 jobs in the next three years. Virginia competed with Pennsylvania, Maryland, and Washington, D.C. for the project. The company will be based at 3951 West Tier Parkway. A juvenile male is under arrest in Henrico, charged for his role in an alleged online extortion campaign that involved local underage girls. Police made the arrest on Friday. The suspect's alleged involvement in the attempted extortion effort took place in November and December last year. The detectives learned that the juvenile suspect would obtain images and videos, allegedly, and threaten to expose those females if they refused to submit additional compromising material of themselves or others, according to police who are withholding the suspect's name because of his age. Now, detectives are urging anyone who believes they or someone they know, including teens or children, could be victims of that criminal activity to contact Detective Von Cannon at 804-347-1776. You can also submit anonymous tips through Metro Richmond Crime Stoppers at 780-1000 or p3tips.com. Here's something to put on your calendar. The Cultural Arts Center at Glen Allen and Henrico Theater Company will join forces and join thousands of other theatrical organizations around the globe by producing their own local production of Music Theater International's All Together Now. The shows will run November 14th and 15th at 7 p.m. each day at the Cultural Arts Center. Tickets are $10 with a suggested donation. The performances will include a number of hit songs, such as Be Our Guest from Beauty and the Beast, Somewhere That's Green from Little Shop of Horrors, and Children Will Listen from Into the Woods. The musical review is part of a national effort to raise recovery funds for local theaters. As of August 2nd, more than 3,800 performances were scheduled at 1,600 schools and theaters from 36 countries and tributaries in all 50 states. If you want to purchase tickets or learn more, you can visit artsglenallen.com or call 261-ARTS. And tonight is the Henrico County Public Schools Band Showcase. It'll take place at 6.30 at Godwin High School's Excel Stadium and will feature performances from marching bands from all nine of the school division's comprehensive high schools. The event is free to attend, but donations will be accepted at the gate for the Henrico Christmas Mother Campaign, and you can meet Christmas Mother Blanche Moore. Donations of canned goods, peanut butter, cereal and crackers, hats, gloves, and socks, as well as monetary support are particularly needed. Refreshments will be available for purchase at the event, but you should carry them to your seats before you consume them to minimize crowding. Godwin's located at 2101 Pump Road.